What's up guys, it's Gino with some NCAA 13 gameplay. This is week two to my dynasty mode as a Washington State Cougars. If you haven't seen the first episode, it's uh, me kind of leading a one-star prestige uh, team to maybe either like a five or six star prestige kind of raising the team from the bottom up or the story Geno Smith maybe leaving Washington State to go to bigger and brighter things maybe win a, a championship so I'm not going to be talking about the gameplay at all in this one I kind of want to go for the goals I have for the next month and just get some things off my chest that I wanted to tell you guys so hope you enjoy the commentary all right guys First thing I want to talk about is my goals of the next month. I'm recording this July 11th. Um, so, as you guys know, Madden 13 comes out in the next month. I think it comes out either August 28th or August 29th. I'm not sure. I'm going to be getting that game three days early because of my EA Season Pass, I think it's called. Um, so, yeah, that should be cool. But my goal of the next month is to get enough subscribers to have a 32-man um, connected careers and if you haven't heard about the connected careers in Madden 13 should be really fun where you could either be a my player or coach and like they kind of combining them into a whole online thing which I think would be cool but I really want to get enough subscribers to get a 30 or 31 other people um, to have only my players or create a superstar or whatever Madden does in that connected careers I think that would be really cool I think it's a pretty realistic goal for the next month. I, I think I have like 130 subscribers now. And um, I think most of you guys play sports games. I talked to a couple of you guys actually on Xbox Live and played with you in NCAA 13. So it should be fun. So yeah, I think it's pretty realistic to try to get 31 other people uh, to be in my Madden Connectus careers. So I mean, hopefully I can get there. I'm going to be still posting a lot of videos. So, yeah, that's my goals of the next month. So, the next thing I want to talk about is MLB 2K12. Um, as you guys know, I do have a franchise and a my player in MLB 2K12. I haven't been posting that a lot lately simply because NCAA 13 just come out. Uh, so, I didn't want to post that either. But I'm really not liking the game much. Um, I, I think I'm going to just stop the franchise mode um, altogether. It's... I, I play on the hardest difficulty, but it's really easy. The graphics are kind of bad. It's just not an enjoyable game to play for me. I think I still might keep the My Player. Um, if you guys still want to see that, I mean, I haven't got that great responses on those on my franchise yet. But I, I kind of started out YouTube with MLB 2K12. I think my first video was episode one to my My Player. So. I, I mean, a lot of you guys came here just for that, so I don't want to quit it if you guys actually want to see it a lot. Um, but I really doubt I'm going to be continuing my um, franchise mode. That's just, it's just not fun for me to play anymore. I'm still not decided on the my player, though. But definitely, for all you, the f uh, select few of you who actually enjoy my MLB 2K12 franchise mode, um, I'm sorry, but it's just not fun for me, and if it's truly not fun for me to play that game, I'm not going to play it. MLB My Player is still fun, but it's, it's really easy. The graphics aren't good. Um, I mean, I raised the difficulty to Legend. It's still really easy. I mean, I'll show you the gameplay. Uh, it's just like I can... It's. I mean, I could get a bunt single every time now. If you raise the speed over 80... You could just get a bunt single every time, steal every base. It's pretty easy. I could show you a video on it if you guys wanted. But my player is pretty easy. So, I mean, I, if you guys really still want to see it, leave it in the comments below. I mean, I, I'll still play it. I'm definitely not playing franchise, but yeah. Oh, and uh, just in case you guys were wondering, I'm still going to be continuing the NBA 2K12, my player. Um, I... It's fun for me still to play that game. I, I like NBA 2K12. I'm not the best at it, so it's kind of like a learning curve I get to go through, which is fun for me. Um, with MLB 2K12, I feel like there's no learning curve. It's easy. I could do it in autopilot mode. I could do it in my sleep. With NBA 2K12, I actually have to try because I'm not used to the NBA games. And I'm not used to the NCAA 13 games either, so those have the games where it's actually a challenge for me to play. It's actually really fun. So, yeah, I'm still going to be continuing NBA 2K12 with my player. Alright, so the last thing I want to be talking about is my NCAA 13 Road to Glory. As you guys hopefully know, I am have a running back named Geno Smith that just signed with Ohio State. 
which that series should be fun as long as I keep up with it. But I want to do another um, Road to Glory series with a defensive player. Um, I'm not sure which player I should use yet. I'm kind of be waiting for the new rosters to do that one. Because with the Dynasty mode, I, I don't have the new rosters. I really don't care about it in Dynasty mode. For my Dynasty mode, it's more about of like the story of raising my one-star prestige team either to like a five or six-star prestige, or my coach to you know move on from a one-star prestige Washington State to like a higher school and win the national championship. So that's more about the storyline of him, not necessarily like all the players and the rosters and all that. So yeah, leave in the comments below what defense because i really i haven't played a road to glory defensive player before in my mind i was thinking like free safety uh cornerback maybe middle linebacker i don't know i really have no experience with defensive players in road to glory maybe you guys have and you had a good time with it leave that in the comments below if you guys would want to see that i definitely want to do another road to glory though two road to glories and i think i could finish maybe I know I could finish him before the next uh, NCAA comes out, but yeah, maybe after I finish those series, I can start two more. I don't know how long um, it will take to finish those two series, especially because I have to edit them, put, post them on YouTube. Um, if some of you guys don't understand, um, I usually have like two Road to Glories, one that I post on YouTube, or two of my players, one that I post on YouTube, and one that I just play on my own. And it's so much easier to finish like a Road to Glory or Road to Glory or my player if you're not posting it to YouTube because I hate having so many stacked gameplays on my computer. That's what I did with my Geno Smith series in MLB 2K12 my player. I had so much stacked on them. I didn't really want to play it anymore. I just want to get all those gameplays out. So, I mean, now I know better that I don't want to get so much gameplay stacked. So I have to wait to play before I put that week on YouTube. So, I mean, I can't finish it in my fast as I was with, uh, if I wasn't posting it to YouTube. Um, just because I, I hate, um, having so many stacked gameplays on my hard drive and it takes a lot of energy out. And I actually had the, for this, uh, actually, game you're watching, um, I was recording it and I was, I mean, all two, or actually, I played three games and all three games I was winning. It was like the third quarter and I looked at my capture card and I was like, too much memory on laptop. I have a really crappy laptop, by the way, that doesn't hold that much stuff. Uh, it has really low gigabytes of memory. So, yeah, so I was like, wow. So I had to delete some stuff. I had to do it over again. I actually had to do that twice before I played the third game that you're watching right now. I mean, I was winning all three games, so it wasn't a big deal. It was just annoying. So, yeah, the, um, uh, back to what I was actually talking about. Leave in the comments below what defensive player you would like me to play. I, I have no idea, so I guess if I, whatever comment I see, I'll probably do it. And, um, so this is going to wrap it up for this commentary, guys. My Dynasty should be fun. Again, if you want to join it, mess, put it in the comments below. I'll add you as a friend on Xbox. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary. Subscribe if you haven't already. See you guys later.